Okay, guys, uh, this is uh, Zulini's dad's quest for the Fountain of Youth. This information I'm about to share with you uh, is meant to be used under various conditions. Uh, here are some quick examples. Let's say you're in an emergency situation. If no other help is available, you can use this technique. Uh, you can use it liberally as a heart strengthening and building technique, like you want to strengthen your heart make it strong or as a as a you know strengthening and building it up technique uh, you can do it like I said whenever you feel like it it's it's basically what what this means is like a it's like an exercise for that particular part of the human body um, you could also use it in an emergency situation in an emergency situation even even if other help is available as a secondary or auxiliary option just something you want to add to the current that I wanted to add to the current treatments like in an emergency response team or something like that uses already um, you could also another quick example is whenever a person feels they need an extra breath to come out from their chest or heart area you're kind of feeling a little faint maybe you have a hangover I don't know you need an extra breath you feel there's something wrong, you need that extra emergency breath, this technique will help. Um, remember, if a heart is capable of only doing 2 billion heartbeats in our lifetime, or 200 billion, or 200 trillion, whatever the record is, it is our duty to find that 200 trillion and one heartbeat. So we gotta actually go out there and find it, and that's why everybody does something different. That's why people do this for work, This. Others choose to fight, others choose to play cards, others, you know, climb trees, cut trees, who knows? That's what we do it, to find that extra heartbeat. That is our duty. So once we find it, once we find that technique, uh, my hope, it should be all our hope, is uh, maybe just we can repeat that extra process indefinitely. Once we find that extra heartbeat, that record heartbeat, we can just repeat it, repeat that process indefinitely. So that's how I came up with this, and I've been studying it, and that's what I do for a living. So I'm gonna. Sh this is how it goes, okay? It's uh, it's it's TikTok dot cock, is what you what a person is supposed to say. TikTok dot cock. Now I whisper it. It's actually proper technique is to whisper it. Um, I noticed that it works very well for people around my height, which is about six foot tall, five eleven, and three quarters and above. It's the only one I could recommend because I use it personally I'm pretty sure we have the same hearts but some of us had injuries some of us don't I know it works for me so this is how it goes tick tock dot cock now say it quickly tick tock dot cock tick tock dot cock tick tock dot cock tick tock dot cock and you've noticed that your whole chest area your heart in specific expands and extracts so you're you're basically using that particular area you're gonna grow it you're gonna make it stronger you're going to use it during an emergency situation. You need that extra breath. And and I speak from experience. It has already worked in my life. I've done it a couple of times when I felt faint. Have you ever heard the term faint at heart? I've used it a couple of times. It does work. So I'm not just throwing it out there. So tick-tock-dot-cock, 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 tick-tock-dot-cock. Tick-tock-dot-cock. Now, um, I say it to those. Uh, the best way is I practice it liberally whenever, the, whenever I feel like it, really. Uh, with the song Duele el Corazon it's by Enrique Iglesias uh, the translation means uh, the heart hurts or it's a painful heart something like that it's called Duele el Corazon by Enrique Iglesias it, it's the beat it's not really him singing it's not really him it's actually the beat it's a really good beat and it works really well he did a good job with that song and I know he cares about it a lot and I am a fan but it is about that beat and I, I use it with that, it works really well with me, but there's, uh, I'm studying other music, uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger has a video co that came out he, with, with some music, and I tested it out, and it, it's doing really well with that one as well, but right now, the only one I'm recommending is Duelo el Corazon by Enrique Iglesias, and, and please whisper it, say it quickly, you're going to hear, you're going to feel your tongue roll, but whisper it, and here's an example of how fast I do it without the music. This is how fast I do it without the music. And 
and it's the full thing tiktok.cock and it's going that quick without the music now when you're listening to with the music you you just do it at his beat tiktok.cock tiktok.cock Okay, so you could do it both ways. Uh, what I try to tell people is just think of it as you're going to buy a, a vehicle. If you never bought one, you're going to go to a car lot and you want to go for a test drive. So take it out for a spin. Take take what I'm take my advice out for a spin. It's not going to hurt you. And you'll see the results. You'll feel the results. Get a stethoscope and you'll notice the results. I could do it without a stethoscope, and I know I'm working that specific area. It's it's it's, it's miraculous. And hopefully, all we have to do is just repeat that process. And we found that extra beat, that extra heartbeat, that record heartbeat. So remember, tick tock tock tick tock tock tick tock tock tick tock tock. And uh, good luck and God bless. And remember, this came to you from Zuini Dat. That's actually my new company, Zuini Dat. I'm its creator. I'm building it. So don't forget where it came from, Zuini Dat. Zuini Dat. Hopefully you'll hear it. All right. See you later.